Other than MicroPython, Raspberry Pi Pico can also be programmed using CircuitPython. It is easy. Get the UF2 file from the CircuitPython website. Press the boot cell button and connect the USB cable. Drag the UF2 file into the RPI RP2 drive. Done! Before that, please like, share, subscribe and press the bell to get the latest update from us. Now I want to write and read data on the SD card using MakerPi Pico. I'm using a Raspberry Pi 400 computer and more editor to write CircuitPython code. You can get the sample code on the Citron tutorial page. This code just covers the basics. To communicate with the SD card, it uses the SPI protocol. SPI clock is connected to GP10, MOSI, GP11, and MISO GP12. The chip select is on the GP15. Then, it will create a text file named PICO with W command and write hello world followed by enter for the next line it uses the a command to add the text this is another line followed by enter the same goes for this line it will add the text last but not least Then, finally, it uses the command R to read the text in the file and display it on the serial monitor below. Save the file to see the result. You can see here, one to three lines are written in the text file in the SD card. Then, it reads the text file and displays it on the serial monitor. Now, I try to change the text. Last but not least, I change to last. Save the file. You can see the result. The text has been replaced. It means the W command is not just creating a new file, but it will override the file with the same name. We can verify more by using a computer. Disconnect the USB cable and take out the SD card. Then, connect the SD card to the computer to access the file. I open the file using the text editor. You can see here, pico.txt has been created and we write three lines as follows. This is the result from the CircuitPython code. This is just the basics to interface the SD card. Next, we can try to do the application like data logging. So that's all for today. You can share your Raspberry Pi Pico projects. I'm Idris from Cytron Technologies. Good luck and thank you for watching.